Today's video we're doing part two. Yes, we're doing part two to the DIY grass slash flower wall. Now, my wall didn't have no flowers at first because I had to get them. Um, where I normally get them from with all this COVID-19 going on, she wasn't taking no orders of the paper flowers that I like to use. So I had to improvise and I decided to get these artificial flowers. I found these at a thrift store by my house. Um, it was $1.99 with 50% off, so it was a dollar, two dollars, three bucks. I paid three dollars. And I'm just going to simply pull the flowers off each one like so. And then I'm going to use a thumbtack to put them on the wall where I want to place them at. Um, these taking all the flowers off and we might even use some of these leaves. So when I posted my first video showing how I did the flower wall, um, I got a lot of questions about like where I got this from. So I'm just going to do a quick little wrap up in this part two video showing you the cheapest way. Actually, I only spent $43 to make this wall. And it looks like even in this angle, it looks so big, like even bigger than it is. It's great for videos, pictures, whatever. But $43 and you can get you a nice wall. So first up, you want to call any of your local landscaping companies. I use Facebook Marketplace, put in my zip code, and they have pictures, everything, the businesses that pull up. I just call them to see if they sold, like, a, I was asking for a 5 by 7 at least a 5 by 7 size piece of grass. And most of them was telling me uh, they only do big square footages for yards, but a lot of them did have scrap pieces that they'll sell for cheap. So... This, my scrap piece was a 5 by 10 cut, and it was $40. I believe I could have got it cheaper, but I didn't um, try to push the issue of bargain. So that was the most expensive piece was the grass, which is $40. And again, the flowers I got from the thrift store for $3. So for $43, literally, you can have a bomb-ass wall. And not only that, especially in a time like this, where it's like stay-home orders and coronavirus, this kind of give you a feel like you in Hawaii or somewhere tropical. So it's kind of like a vision board, but a, uh, like an energy wall too. Because like every time I look at it, I just can't help but feel happy or like I'm somewhere tropical. So after Corona, you know what I'm probably going to end up being thanks to just energy and visual things. Because I keep thinking about it now, it's somewhere tropical. But that's a whole nother video. When I was putting these on, I got one up there and I would, would attack that the... Um, it's too thick for the tack to go through. So, we'll be using none other than the classic hot glue gun. I'm going to put a little bit of glue. It ain't going to take much to make it stick. I'm going to put a little bit of glue so I can still be able to pull it down when I want to without damaging. But other than that, I got my flowers. And we can get started. So happy together. Now ain't that a fancy and cute. But know that she won't last forever. Wait till she sees the real you. You wait until you put her through. Everything you put me through. Should I be my passion? I know you can feel the tears. It is kind of giving me like Hawaiian vibes. Yeah. Which I'm not all the way mad at. <laughs> but this is just one wall. My other wall. I'm 